Hello everyone and welcome to your Drawings by Me art tutorial. Today you will be creating a rain of colour picture. You will be learning how to develop your ideas as you create your artwork and talk about it, using thick and thin lines to draw and annotate your design. In this lesson we will be inspired by an artist who loves to use watercolours and Chinese inks to create beautiful images of silhouettes surrounded by a flurry of colour. Do you know who we're inspired by today? It's Mark Alante. Mark was born in Hong Kong and has also lived in Sydney and London. All of the places he has lived inspired him to create paintings using techniques from different countries and he often uses Chinese ink and European watercolours. He uses a variety of themes in his art but loves the environment and animals. The resources you will need will be a black pen, a pencil and a range of coloured pens. Make sure that you have more than four different colours. This is what your Alante drawing could look like. I chose to draw myself in the middle and the cartoon person might look different to yours. To start, practice drawing you as a cartoon with one arm up as you are going to be holding an umbrella. You can keep the face very simple and keep on practicing until you are happy with your drawing. When you are ready, first draw you as a cartoon in the middle of your paper, at the bottom. Make sure you are holding one arm up and then you can draw the umbrella. When you are happy with your cartoon sketch of yourself, outline your design using a black pen. Add in any details and colour the umbrella black as this is going to be a silhouette, which means a shadow. Remember your cartoon will look different to mine as it will be representing you. Shade the umbrella very carefully, making sure there are no white gaps or spaces. Now for the exciting part, you can begin to add in the colourful rain. Starting from the top, make lines that look like water running from the sky, all the way to the bottom. If it hits the umbrella, follow the umbrella line and then down. If you have two colours next to each other that mix, add the colour that it makes next to it. For example, I have red and yellow rain stripes here running down, so I mix them together to make orange and it looked like the water had mixed together. Not all of your colours will mix together, but like I've done here, my yellow and blue is green and then all the other colours running down stay the same colour. Fill your entire background with the lines of colourful rain. Then you can add pools of watercolours at the bottom, again mixing some colours to create secondary colours if needed. Make sure you have a range of thick and thin lines falling from the sky. Now it is time to write all the emotions that you can think of linking to the colours along the lines of the rain. I chose happy emotions for the yellow colours, angry or sad for the red and loving emotions for the pink. You can choose whichever emotions you feel represent the colours. And remember, positive and negative emotions are all okay. There you have your Mark Alante inspired reign of emotions. Discuss how yours makes you feel and share with your friends. Enjoy drawing and remember to tag us in any pictures you take of your wonderful art.